Someday I would buy galleys with good oars and sails to distant shores. Stand up high in the prow, noble bark I steer. Steady course for the heavens, you many foemen. My mother told me someday I would buy guys with good oars. This is um, this is Craig Fair. This is the interesting part. I can see the whole world from here. I can see the whole world from here. Yeah, you can. The whole world. Nice little walk. What the kiddie winkles? The sound's going to be shit because I'm not using my mic. Apologies for that. Now we've got to walk all the way back down. Sails to distant shores Stand up high in the proud Noble bark I steer Steady coast for the havens Humane foemen Humane foemen Humane foemen How you doing guys? Welcome to the Skint Vapor channel. I am Skint and uh, I hope you enjoyed that by the way. That was um, Craig Farah, which is about five minutes from me, from where we live, the house, the cottage. Five minutes from the cottage and it took about 15-20 minutes from leaving the house to go to the top. Five minutes from here to the, uh, the car park and then you walk up the hill and You've got that amazing, fucking stunning view. Amazing, it's a beautiful place. And you've got the old fucking Pictish fort where they believe that uh, a Pictish king had his. That was his place. His house, so to speak. Yep, back in 500 and something. Um, yeah, it's a lovely place. It's really nice, it's gorgeous, and the view is stunning. You can see it all over the Beaulieu Firth and the River Ness. Amazing, gorgeous. But today we are here for a hardware review. Yes, we are. This is a little K Fun Light 24mm mouth to lung. I'm trying to break into mouth to lung a little bit more. This is my second mouth to lung tank. Uh, it was a Wasp Nano RTA I got as my first mouth to lung tank, and I fucking hated it. Now, I don't know if it was a tank or whether it was me, the fact that I'm struggling to get along with mouth to lung. It might just be, I'm a, I've been direct to lung more or less since I started vaping, uh, apart from the cigarettes and shit like that. And uh, it's a little bit of a struggle to get used to it, you know what I mean? However, I got this little jammy off AliExpress for about, fuck, £12 I think. £12. Yep, yeah, £12 from AliExpress. Uh, the, the seller on AliExpress was Cool Vape. Now the link, I'll put a direct link on my website, go to skintvapor.com, look for the, the blog post for this video and I'll put the direct link in there directly to where I got this. However, um, now don't ask me to repeat this, it's fucking Savu Mestu or something, it's German or something like that, or fucking Russia, I don't know, German I'm guessing. Um, <sighs> I just, I'm shite at pronouncing these names. K Fun Light 2019 version, by the looks of it, from f as far as I can tell. I have no experience with K Funs, but looking at other reviews and stuff like that, it looks like it's a 2019 version. But we're going to go down low, we're going to have a nosy posy, a wee sniff at it, uh, and we're going to have a, a coil and wick. I'll come back up, I'll tell you what I think.
So guys, with this you get this extension piece in a little box as well, which replaces the shorter tank there, and that's the way I've been using it. I'll show you, you get another extension for your chimney, that's your little extension piece for the chimney, and all that does is go on this piece. Is on there like that. To sing another silly love song about this crazy weather in me. Stars glisten in the blue and the black filament. She got a letter with my name on that I've never sent. just show you here before I do this. If you unscrew the deck, this is took from this is from the 2019 version uh, through what I've seen online, but if you unscrew the deck, I get my other screwdriver, you can control the airflow by this there's a little screw in there, you should be able to see that hopefully. See it? Down in there there's a little flathead screw. And if you screw it up and down you'll see in this that way. You should see inside here the that screw will come up and down. It's hard for you to see. Sorry, I've not got very good fucking light in here. But that screw will come up and down in there. It's not showing you. You just need to take my word for it, for a control the airflow. I was saying in the video uh, in Bargain Vapes Live the other day, um, this fusion cotton can be very delicate when pulled through the coil. So I do a Scottish roll. Now in an old Scottish roll you used to separate your Muji cotton and then roll it. I just roll it with my fingers basically. I don't separate it. I'm just rolling it. 
just to toughen it up, tighten it up a wee bit and get it twisted together a bit more. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free. I don't know, you know, I don't know, by the way, not about the tank, I don't know about my song, I'm struggling, it's, I'm str it's, I've got to teach myself a new way of vaping. I think if I'd started in mouth long, I would probably like it a lot more. It's nice, I'm getting there, I'm getting there, I'm trying hard. I've also got a, a nice mouth long uh, squonking RDA coming that I'm, got, I'm looking forward to trying out. Yeah, um, so the K1 light, as you saw down below, it's it's not overly difficult to to build on and work and stuff like that, and it's working perfectly, working no problems. I put um, proper coils, nice long coil on here. I had one left that I bought from uh, Prop Coils. I had one left, and I put that in there for this build in this video, and it's uh, quite big in this deck. But do you know what the fucking the flavour has jumped quite a bit. <laughs> Fallout coils are nice, but I did do something different. I raised the coil a bit higher with the proper coils coil in this one. I don't know why, I just thought I'm going to bring that up a bit more. And uh, it's improved the flavour. Yep, very good. Um, just trained myself to fucking use it. The flavour's nice, the flavour's lovely. The airflow is, yeah, it's not too restricted. So it's, I'm finding it easy to get into. I've been finding it easy to use. I am picking it up and away we go. The filling method, taking the bottom off the fucking, you need to, this has no top cap fill or anything like that. You've got to take the tank off, take the bottom off and fill it in that manner. Now you'd think that was a pain in the fucking arse, especially in this day and age when we're used to just fucking slides or unscrewing and away you go. But I don't mind. Because it's mouth to lung, so it's taken quite a long time for the tank to empty, especially when we use a bigger tank. And it's not as much a problem then. Uh, doing that with a direct to lung would be a pain in the fucking arse. Yeah, it's alright, the drip tip's okay as well, a bit tight on there, I've had to use my teeth to get it off. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it seems really nice. Now, is it a fucking clone? Is it a clone? I'm guessing so. 
I'm guessing so. It's difficult to tell. Usually I can tell from the comments and stuff like that. There was no comments that I, I noticed. Uh, I didn't look really in detail, but there's no comments that I presumed it was a cone, so I just took it for granted it was a cone. But it came in very good packaging, as you saw down below. And the product itself is fucking quality. Very good quality. The I don't know if this was a 2019 version, but I saw in some drip tips it had the... Uh, a little logo, that little logo there, if you can see that, it had that little logo on the drip tip, this doesn't, it's just a plain drip tip, does that mean it's a clone, fuck knows, I don't know, I'll be honest with this one guys, I am not sure if it's clone or not, if it is a clone it's a very fucking good one, it's a top quality clone then, in my opinion. 12 quid! 12 fucking pounds. Jesus McCreasus and his holy wee sister. That is insane. 12 pounds for this little jammy. Yep. Uh, and I think if you bought this when it came out, it was some 70, 80 pounds, maybe more. I don't know. It was fucking too much for me. Put it that way as the skin vapor. Check it out, guys. I'll put the link, direct link to where I got this from. Cool Vape on the store was Cool Vape on AliExpress. I've used Cool Vape before, we've had a, oh, we had a little bit of a deal where they sent me two of things for me to put as a giveaway on, uh, or as a get shit, on Bargain Vapes Live. Um, they don't, they don't do that anymore, they're just some, but I'm still buying from them because their delivery, this came in six fucking days, six days. I have had comments when I put, I put a little teaser pick up asking people if they could guess what tank this was and I had comments about the delivery, six days. Six days. Uh, cool vape are usually um, seven to 14 days. Sometimes I'm getting them in six days. I don't know why. I don't know how. But I'm not going to fucking complain, am I? Perfect. Uh, thank you very much, you superstars, for giving this little cheeky video a watch. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the... I hope you enjoyed the outdoory bits as well, which I'm trying to get more into, taking the kids out and about and trying to do a bit of filming. Um, when I'm out and about to put in the videos because I, I'm trying to get fat I'm trying to get some fresh air and I'm trying to get out and about more since we're all fucking locked up getting out for our exercise, our daily exercise and uh, I'll do more of that if you like me know in the comments if you enjoyed that if you like me know in the comments anything you know about this tank the, and if you're looking to buy this tank check the comments and see if anybody's left any tips, tricks or complaints about this tank which are also very helpful you guys are very helpful. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you again in the next one. Until then, take care and have fucking fun. Yes, that's right. You said that there, didn't you? You said fun. Yeah, plenty of fucking fun. <laughs>